Hi everyone, this is Dr. Rochon. I'm very excited to announce that we've improved the formula for our Elemental Heal Elemental Diet Meal Replacement Shakes. The taste has improved, but we have reduced the carbohydrate content by roughly 10 grams per serving. So it's still the same gut-friendly, gluten-free, hypoallergenic, casein-free, lactose-free formula that can help to heal your gut. And yes, if you're lactose intolerant, you can use this, but now taste is better and there's 10 grams less, roughly, carbs per serving. Also, one of the oils that can be added to your Elemental Heal Shake is a MCT or medium chain triglyceride oil. If you've ever used one of these oils, as I have, you notice that they're greasy, they leak, and they kind of stick to everything, and they're really messy to clean up. I'm happy to announce that we've just released a MCT, or medium chain triglyceride oil powder, to make it much easier for you to add healthy fats to your Elemental Heal Shake. What's nice about MCT oil is that it can aid in bowel regularity, they are very easy fats for your GI to absorb. They also can aid in ketone production and in cognition. So there's a number of health benefits that can be garnered from using a MCT oil. If nothing else has worked for your gut, I would highly recommend considering a trial on an elemental diet. Now, what does the elemental diet do and why can it be helpful? In case you haven't caught this before, elemental diets help to starve bacterial overgrowth, like small intestinal bacterial overgrowth. It's my opinion that they also help to starve fungal overgrowth because remember, Although there is carbohydrate in these solutions, they become absorbed within the first roughly three or so feet of the small intestine. So there's not anything that gets down the line to help feed a fungal overgrowth. So while we don't know for sure, it's my view that even those who have fungal overgrowths likely could help to starve and reduce the fungal overgrowth by using an elemental diet. Also remember, because you're taking some time off of foods, and for many people with impaired digestion, foods can act as antigens or, or inflammatory triggers. When you take some time away from food, you actually give your body a break, your gut a break, a rest, and a chance to heal. The analogy I often use is if you sprain your ankle and you're running three miles every day, it'd be hard to heal. Same thing with your gut. If your gut is inflamed and you're eating three meals every day, it can be hard to heal. And so the elemental diet can be used as a way to give your gut some rest. Also remember that elemental diets are not hard. Please don't let internet reading mistakenly lead you to believe that elemental diets are difficult. Now, ours tastes, in my opinion, very good. Not all do, but the newer formulas tend to taste great. So don't let taste fool you. Yes, the older formulas tasted bad. The newer formulas, especially including our revised formula of Elemental Heal chocolate and vanilla, I think are very, very palatable. If you're not adding fat to your Elemental Heal shakes, consider adding some and consider adding the MCT oil specifically as one of the options that can be added into your shake to make it creamier so it tastes better, but also to make it more satiating and help keep you fuller, longer, and not feeling hungry. Also, you don't have to use these in an exclusive application. What does this mean? Well, in, in some of the research literature, these diets, these elemental diets have been used exclusively, meaning no food in some cases for up to two weeks. Yikes, but you don't have to do that. You can actually do what's known in the research literature as a hybrid diet, meaning perhaps you skip breakfast and you sip on an elemental shake and you have a small lunch and a normal dinner, or perhaps you do one day off of food completely and do this kind of liquid fast and then have normal food the next day. You have flexibility. You can work this into your diet to whatever um, aspect uh, fits with your life. So don't think you have to do these things exclusively for weeks or for days. You can use these as a meal replacement and even that one meal replacement period will give your gut some time off of food and help with that whole reset, rest, and starvation of some of the bad bugs. And also remember that irrespective of how you're using Elemental Heal Shakes, you can add an oil to them to help keep you fuller for longer. Consider adding our MCT oil powder to your shake as a way to not only help with cognition, ketone production, but also to provide your body with healthy fats, 
that will help you satiate it longer as you're trying to do this, this gut reparative elemental heal reset. So again, don't think you have to use these things at the kind of varsity level for two weeks exclusively. There is some wiggle room and these things are pretty accessible. If, if you just are okay with listening to your body and not needing to go to these extremes of, of two weeks. Helpful for some people, yes, but for some people, if they skip breakfast on most days and have an elemental heel shake, that is a nice win for them and moves them forward in terms of how their gut is feeling. So if nothing else is working for your gut, I hope you will try our elemental heel, which now thankfully has an improved flavor profile and also has done so with 10 less grams of carbs per serving. And if you're looking to add a little fat into that to help with satiation, cognition, uh, and also to use healthy fats to help support healing of your gut, consider adding in our MCT oil powder along with your Elemental Heal Shake as part of your daily gut healing routine.